House press secretary, and thank God you're not. But if you were, you would have two tasks every day. Did you forget what you wanted to say? Okay, I'm listening. You have my attention now. You've got to learn the president's views on what's happening in the world so you can repeat them. And then you've got to try to remember the names of those weird-looking people sitting in the folding chairs in the briefing room. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> So it's not an easy job, but it's not a very rewarding one either. You're not making policy. You're not making decisions. You're repeating the party line. Wait for it. Wait for it. Under normal circumstances, it takes a lot more creativity to say, sell lipstick for L'Oreal than it does to be White House press secretary. I don't know. That's crazy. <laughs> They're all worn out by the end. Except under Joe Biden. It's a totally different job under Joe Biden. The rules have changed. If you're Joe Biden's press secretary, you've got to be able to think on the fly because your boss can't. Nope. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so every time Biden goes outside, you're going to be called upon to translate what he said or explain what he really meant, assuming for the sake of argument that he really meant anything at all. I know you're frustrated, Biden said today, for example. I can taste it. What the hell? 